But right now we're joined by Sarah Simpson from Beauty EQ and we're talking about the best thing to do in these cooler months and that is have a lovely hot bath. Good morning Sarah. Hi Mel, how are you? I'm great and I love having a bath. Oh, so, so do I. Yeah, so and I think it's something that lots of people forget that there's a bathtub just dying to be filled up and soaked in. Absolutely, great yeah. way to get away from the husband, the kids. Yeah, absolutely, um, lock the door, yeah. do not disturb sign. Totally, yeah, <laughs> champagne, wine. Yeah. But I'm interested in what you would suggest to do to unwind in the bath. Well, I think what the most important thing is to make it a moment, you know, um, escape the world, lock the door, like I'm actually serious when I say that, light a candle, dim the lights or turn the lights off completely and just really have some time for you, make it an experience. Mm, sounds good. I like sounds to, very tempting, I like to doesn't read. It? I always have a book in there. Um, what about uh, the product? What kind of products would you have in the bath? I think it's important. You don't need to go out and buy everything um, for the bath. I think you can tailor your skincare and your tools to what you need. If you need to exfoliate, you can get a sugar scrub. If you feel that you need some hydration, you can get a bath oil. You pick and choose what you want to get out of a bath. You can even get inflatable pillows mm. that suction onto the back of the bath, so you really can, you perfect for you with your book. I've got one of those. Oh, do you? Yes. Except for I broke it in half. Oh, yeah, so that's now not ideal. I know, it <laughs> sucks, I'm going to have to get a new one. Um, what about the temperature? Because um, I like it hot, but it's probably not that great so for So do I. Skin. Now, unfortunately, I've been um, stung by that as well. Ideally it shouldn't be too hot because what that does, it does a couple of things. First of all it dries out your skin and takes off all of your natural oil barrier but also you probably won't spend as long in the bath as you should to really relax because you've made it so piping hot. Mm. So try and dial back on the heat just to make it, so it's still nice and toasty but you'll have a really nice rest if you don't have it as hot as you know, when you have to dip in ever so slowly because you've made it so hot. Or, or what you can do is you make it warm and then you get in there and then you put the hot water yeah, on exactly. until it's about up to here. Um, if you're a bath person, how long do you usually stay in the bath for? I think 10 to 15 minutes is lovely. Oh, that's not very long. time to escape. Sometimes, you Maybe know, it should, yeah. Sometimes, well, whatever you like. Yeah. However long you need to escape your children and husband for. <laughs> well, what I do is I go and do some exercise uh, at about nine o'clock after I've dropped the kids off, and then I'll go back to my house, then have a bath. Oh, lovely. Mm. See, it's a nice, it's a ritual. It's really important to have those little moments for yourself. Now, tell me, you have actually brought some products here. I've brought some really lovely goodies in. So, starting off, I think it's really important to always have a candle, and I love this little mini Aquia candle. So, just have a few of them maybe, light them up, let the oh. scent fill the room, isn't it beautiful? Let the fragrance fill the room while you're drawing your bath and just, it will smell so divine. What flavour is that? Is that passion fruit or something? Uh, guava. Oh guava, that is so nice. And the whole thing, it looks really pretty yeah, too, doesn't it? Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? Like yeah. you don't mind that being on beside your bath. No. So we've got that. We've got this beautiful um, bath oil from Pure Fiji. Now that, you can see, is actually solid and it solidifies when it's um, cold, so being winter, it's solid. So pop that into the bath while you're running it and it will start to liquefy and put a few drops in and your skin will feel so hydrated when you get out. It's absolutely amazing. Um, it smells quite nice. It says it's star fruit. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. What's star fruit? A beautiful fruit. Oh look, we've got <laughs> we've got coconut, macadamia, <laughs> dillo nut oils. It dillo nut, very dillo. famous okay. for their dillo nut and the pure Fiji very range. Nice. Okay, what else have we got? Next here? up, we've got a body wash, and I think it's really important with, especially with body wash, to go for something that's natural or organic. It goes straight down the drain, and to protect our environment and our planet, I think it's lovely to look for an organic product. This is 98% natural, and it's an absolutely beautiful hand and body wash. So just have that on hand, give yourself a little bit of a scrub up when you're in there. That's probably quite good for your skin as well, right? Very good for your skin. Yeah, okay. What then else? we've got a hair mask. I think there's no better time than um, when you're in the bath to pop a hair mask this on. This here? This one here. So you pop it through your hair like a conditioning treatment. Either put a shower cap on or a warm towel. And while you're sitting back reading, you can let that penetrate through your hair and really do... My, my husband loves it when I put a shower cap on. <laughs> it's so sexy, isn't it? It's the sexiest thing. What does it do for your hair? It nourishes. So okay. depending on what your hair needs are, you can get a hydrating one, you can get a strengthening one, a nourishing one. You can pick and choose from those um, handy little sachets. I need one that um, grows back my hair where it's gone bald after having children. Oh, I know. They're terrible for making us <laughs> bald, aren't they? How cute are these? So these are little iPads from QVS. Pop them in the fridge for 10 to 15 minutes or while you're putting your bath on. And then as you lie back, just pop them on your eyes and they're really good for tired eyes, puffy eyes. 
good excuse to have a little snooze in the bath. That is fantastic, I think. Yeah, no, that would yep, be great. Yeah, they're gorgeous. And last but not least, we have a good old body brush. Oh, yes. Gets all those hard to reach places. You could pop some of the um, your body wash on there and get um, to the back or down to your feet. So it's just handy tools like that that yeah. just make the bathing experience a little bit more pampering. Oh, yeah. I think I'd like a slightly longer one so I can get right down to the... <laughs> yeah. But yeah, no, that's nice and that, that would feel really, really good. Yeah, um, a little massage and yeah. exfoliation all at once. And of course, um, you can get all of these on your website, can't you? Yeah, yeah. head to beautyeq.co.nz. OK, well, thank you so much for thank that. Thank you for um, having me. I'm definitely going to be lighting a candle and putting some beautiful product in mine. So thank good girl. you. Thank so as Sarah said, um, head to our website, beautyeq.co.nz.